Okay guys, so if you look right up in there, you can see that seal. That's the seal we need to get out right there. And it's got a small brass looking or copper looking lip around it. And uh, sometimes you can get a picky tool up in there. Here, you wanna hold that right there. And sometimes you can get a, go that way just a hair. Right there. Okay. Yeah. Um, sometimes you can get a picky tool in there. Sometimes you can get a pair of needle nose in there. But what I try to do, if they're gonna be a booger, and this one's gonna be, is I bend the tip of it right there, prying on the valve body a little bit. I'll get some comments about that. Just like that, you see how it's lifting that lip? A little bit more here. Just like that, see that lip sticking up? Now I'm gonna take a small screwdriver here and just tap. That brass will be much softer than the actual outer side of the valve body. So you're gonna tap where you're leaning towards the brass and you're not leaning towards the valve body. Just like that, and we're gonna give her a bend and pull as we bend. Should be able to get in there with a pair of needle nose now if you need to. Pretty much anything should grab it and pull it right out. And that's it. And there it is right there. So let's get the new one, let's get it installed. Okay guys, so here's the new one here. here I'll hand that foam to you. And uh, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna get a socket the same size. See how it sits on there nice and flat, lets it move around. And I got it on a small extension. That's because I'm gonna tap it with a hammer. Mm -hmm. So we try to push it up there and see if it'll seat a little bit. Sometimes you gotta put a little oil or grease on it to get it to hold. And I can't get it, so we'll just set it on the socket. Try that. Set it in there. Maybe get it straight. Um, and then we're going to tap it with a hammer. Hear that flat, solid thud? That means she's in. And there it is.